Facebook group. And okay, the microphones are on. Uh, <laughs> no, we're all going to have a little meeting on this side. Little meeting so so Brent can lecture you. We lost. There she is. <laughs> Review. We're having a meeting. All right, so I'm very impressed. Everybody's got the plant part. Um, so I was saying that ladies have, a in my experience, and a lot of years, two decades coaching ladies, um, I see the, um, the failure to plant in a lot of ladies and movement during the shot in a lot of ladies, more so than in guys. Um, so I mean, making you aware of it and correcting that, I think will help you play better. Um, and I think if you watch the video after today and compare it to the way you were volleying before today, I think you'll see a difference. I mean, Angela has already seen an immediate improvement in her volleys, just in the videos, right? I watch it with my coffee the next morning. It's a good time to watch it, right? Because when are you going to watch it? Yeah. So the next morning I go, oh, wow. <laughs> Susie looks funny. No, I don't say that. <laughs> no. No, I don't. I, I go, I wish I looked like Susie. How come I don't look like Susie? Sorry? Yeah, they're on our Racket Network YouTube channel. You now, the, there's no names, the so I don't, I don't name you individually, so nobody's going to find them on a search. Um, the time of day is not listed, so if you're skipping work to be ah. here, nobody knows. It, it says the day. The day is indicated. Uh, but you can't tell from inside here what the time of day is. So you could have done it at 6 o'clock in the morning or at 8 o'clock at night. Nobody knows. Um, and like I say, you're not identified by name. So, um, All right. So but we people will, can find this we've been working on no password on it. Yeah. We've been working on plant and then hit, plant and then hit. I've communicated to all of you to be strong. We're going to work more on the strong now. So we're going to be moving more to one side so that we have to step more often to volley. So these new volleys, we're going to be moved off to this side. You're going to have to step into the line of the ball. So as the ball is coming out of the machine, you've got to read the line that it's on. And I want you to step into the line of the ball or close to the line of the ball so that you can, you can make your volley with strength. And that means give it in the wrist, elbow bent, shoulder, everything engaged, solid. We're not slapping the ball. Slapping creates weakness because now we've got too much movement, right? So right now we're trying to receive the ball. Okay, so that's the task. Now I want to give you one tip. Hope it's not too much information today. I'm noticing that a lot of you are struggling with making contact in the center of the racket. The most neurosensitive, one of the most neurosensitive points in your body is the tip of your index finger. Your body, your brain knows where the tip of that index finger is or would be even if it wasn't extended, even if it's not extended. That's how strong the neural connection is. So when your hands are on the paddle, if you imagine that your neural fi your finger is pointing at the ball, it's going to help you. If you think about where would my finger be pointing, I want to make contact just above where my finger would be pointing, right? Your brain will figure out where that, you know, it'll find the center of the paddle more easily. So think about when the ball is coming, you're trying to center the ball in your paddle. Think about where would my index finger be pointing? Because your brain is going to find that spot very, very quickly because it knows it very, very well. Okay? It doesn't know the paddle, but it knows your index finger. So if you think of the paddle as an extension of your hand, where would my index finger be pointing? It's going to help. She doesn't know where her index finger is. <laughs> she was like, huh? This would be your middle finger. <laughs> this would be your index finger. See, so her neural pathways are not open. If I said point at your nose, what would you do? Would you do this? <laughs> She's cute, though. <laughs> she, she is, is cute. cute. <laughs> and okay. her ass isn't fat. <laughs> so anyway, that, that should help you center the ball um, if you're struggling with, with making center contact in, this, in the middle of the paddle. So think about where your index finger would be. All right, but I don't want that to get lost. I don't want that to lose our central point, which is step in front, right, and block. So we're going to be starting a little bit off to this side. So who was first last time? Me. Uh, young luck. Okay, so we'll start there. I hate then, going first. Well, Fine. You can go first. So the four of you can go over there, work on what you've been working on, right? Um, this time over there, instead of lining up, straddling the green line, I want you to line up 
to one side of the green line so that more of the balls are passing you on this. Oh, I guess, wait a minute. There's no green line Two over people. there. We have it oscillating, don't we? Two people yeah. over there. So just line, the white line over there, if you're on the side with the white line, a line a little bit to the left of that line. And on this side, I guess, line a little bit to the outside so you're taking more forehands, right? Does that make sense? Because I don't want you cra clashing in the middle. Okay, I'm going to work with each of you one on one again. I don't know if you can get your. Position. What will happen in middle balls over there? Sorry? What will happen in middle balls? Same they, thing. It's like every fourth ball is middle. Okay, well, they're going to have to communicate. Somebody's going to have to try and get it or let it go. Okay. okay, so just a little bit to the left. Yep, there we go. That's a good spot. I'm to the right. Sorry, to the right. What did I say? Left? Don't mess with me. <laughs> All right. Here we go. Let me make sure everything's on. Yeah, we're on. Here we go. It's on. Plant, block. Plant, block. Good. Good start. Yeah, try and get right behind it. Get your body right behind it. Oh, sorry, hang on, hang on. So you're not stretching. Yeah. You've got to step left. Step hard and far. I'd rather you step past the ball. Just try and step past the ball. What do you mean by past? Past wherever the ball is going to be. Try and step past that point. Ah, oh, yeah. like over, yeah. over. There you go. I see. Okay. So it's more center. Yeah. You want to straddle the line of the ball. Did you hear that? You want to straddle the line of the ball. Oh. Got to get that foot down first. I did the opposite. I know. Get the foot down first. You really got to work hard at getting that foot down first. It's an explosive movement to get that foot down Step first. Step all the way down. There you go. Much better. Hit one more and then step aside. No, other side. I said hit one more and then step aside. Okay, I want to show you how you're going to step. Right now you're stepping up and over like you're going over a hurdle. I want you to step just straight out to the side. It's more of a slide, right? So. Show me what I'm doing. You're going up and over. I want you to just show pretty much slide straight over. Oh, that's If you right. can. So you're, getting, you're going to get low as you slide, rather than coming up over top like this. Right now you're kind of stepping up and over. I want you to get low first and then move. Right. So the first movement is a little bit down. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, I think so. Much better. That's the way you do it. You can hear me better when I'm behind you, can't you? Yeah. Okay, so I'll be behind you. That's an excellent movement. Good. So you're moving down first. You're lowering your center of gravity. That's good. Much better. That was interesting. I want to beat the ball. Good. Now really work at getting that foot down first. I 
I know I'm going the wrong way. We'll get the timing down. I'm not going to nag you. That was really well done. That was really well done. Yep. You were still before the ball got there. What? That what? A, that was a tough one. Ah. Okay, keep practicing. I'm going to go get a replacement. Patricia, come with me. Hi, Patricia. You taking my place? Stay there. You coming? Oh. Stay there till I move you. Okay, you understand what we're doing, right? Yeah. So we're going to be a little bit to offline, and you're going to be taking mostly on your backhand. So you're going to plant first, and then then make contact. No slapping. Sure. Yep. Well, if it's on the right hand, on the forehand side, you're going to plant first, then block. So it goes plant, block, plant, block, plant, block. Right? If it's coming straight at you, plant, block. Right, so that should be in that order. Okay, one more on the left. Okay, switch, slide out left. There you go, Patricia. On the left, can you pick up two tubes of ball before you go? Sure. Two tubes, thank you. That's good. That's a little far. Oh, we might be out of balls. Hang on, I got it. Okay, get a little closer to the green line. Just a little bit go to this oh, green line. I'm sorry, it's too green. Oh, so. Oh, oh. Okay, here it comes. Slow time. Slow time. That's beautiful. Plant, block. Plant, block. Nice. Beautiful. You got this. I feel, I feel like Patricia's always had this. No. No? Okay. You can hit one more and then step aside. Okay? Okay, step to your left. Okay. Now I need to explain something to you. The plant motion is explosive. It happens very, very quickly. Right? But then the block is kind of passive, right? So we have an explosive motion followed by a passive motion, right? So they're, they're, they happen at different speeds, right? So this is explosive. This is called reactive strength, right? So one more. React, pass. Okay, we can hop in. What I was trying to say is, I feel like Patricia, you know, the nonchalant part of Patricia has had this more so than others. Yes, I would agree more so, but she still didn't I think I was trying hard. to say that, but I didn't, it didn't come out right. Good. I like the explosiveness of your plant. Good. Now you got an explosive plant. Who, who do you want me to send over, Brent? Anybody? You can. Uh, I'll come and get them. You okay. can take off. Slow time. Slow time. Okay. I, I'll get somebody. Thank you. You want Charlotte, me come on over. Bye, Charlotte. All right. So she's standing to the left of the green line. 
so that she's taking mostly backhands. She's planting and then she's blocking. So we plant and block. But I really want you to notice that the block is explosive. It happens very, very, or sorry, the plant is explosive. It happens very, very quickly. So that's explosive, and then the block is passive. Okay. Right? So there are two different speeds happening here, right? Right? So I want you to very quick, very quick plant, that's explosive, and then relax for the passive part. Okay? We're going to get in line behind her, just like we did before. Patricia, keep hitting until I tell you to step out left, okay? Are you ready? Okay, one more and then step out left. Good stuff. Step out left. All right, good work, Patricia. You can pick up one tube, yeah, and then take off. Remember, no slapping. Ah, it's a nice block. Yes. Don't need to slap. Slap or no slapping. Oh, slap are we no way slapping. over? Sorry. Woo! Good. Yeah. Uh-huh. Oh, plant was a little slow there. Much I better plant. I find this machine so much easier than the other one. Good. Yeah, if you can... You're doing great. Get a little closer to the green line so you're not stepping as far. There we go. Okay. You're doing great. Okay. Good. I'll, I'll come and get them when I'm ready. I'll come and get them when I'm ready, okay? No, that's not us. Much, very nice. Okay, one more, okay, now step aside. Let me step in. Do uh, you know what straddling means? If I tell you to yeah. straddle the line? Yeah. Okay, so I, the ball is coming out, it's coming along a line. Yeah. I want you to straddle that line, get one foot on each side of the line so that you can get most of your body behind the shot. Right? Sometimes you're gonna guess wrong, yeah. but I want you to try and get one foot on either side of that line when you plant. Are we over to the you side? Plant so that you're in a much stronger position, okay? Oh, nice get. Nice almost get. Little reach. Very good, Charlotte. Well, you're starting with a really wide stance. Maybe narrow it up initially. So if you're a little narrow initially, you have more room to step out. Here we go. Go. Very good. Good. I like that split step. Very good. You're doing great, Charlotte. And. Come and run with and. me. It's you. Do you find this machine easier? Very good. Okay, I want you to notice two things about oh. what's happening here. Do you here. find it easier, Patricia? Okay, first of all, her, I find it way her stance easier. is very, her plant is very explosive. So it happens very, very quickly. The second thing is she's straddling the ball. So as the ball comes out of the machine, it's going to come along a line. She's getting one foot on either side of that line. See that? Okay. So now, it's important to understand that the plant part is explosive. It happens very, very quickly. But the volley part, which happens after, is very passive. Right? So we're going to go two different speeds here. Explosive and then passive. Explosive and then passive. Straddling the line. Making sense? Uh, yeah. It looks like it's not making sense. What is it you don't understand? But, uh, when you're receiving the ball. So oh. explosive, right? And then the block is passive because you're waiting for the ball to come to you, right? Exactly. Yeah. So, so, but people have trouble. They think they're moving at the same speed. Those are two very different Woo! things, right? The first one, the plant is very explosive. I want you to just explode into that plant. Then you're set. Then you're passively waiting for the ball to come in, ah. and then you just block. Make sense? Okay, so we're going to go behind her. 
and then I'm, we're, we're going to move forward. Keep hitting until I tell you to move, okay? I'm going to tell you to step left after your next ball. You're going to move forward. There you go. Step left. You're going to move forward. There we go. Ah, uh, yeah. Pick up uh, two tubes before you go. So. Reach. Yep. I like your stance to start. Very good. Straddle that ball. Straddle the line. Oh, are we out of balls? Just hang on. Here they come. Ah. Oh, that was bad. Plant and block. Nice, Anne. Beautiful plant. Whoa! Nice try. We would never be this far apart, Susie. Ah, you got it. That was a good block, good plant. Ah, good plant. Oh, got a little behind you. Yes, nice. Yours. A little more aggressive on the plant. You ready, Patricia? That's okay. Ah, Patricia's. Doing great, Ann. Okay. Ah. Keep working on it. I'm going to go get somebody else. Who haven't I done? Susan. Come on over. Ty, you want to come in? Patricia, watch it. Ty, do you want to come in? I was just in. Nice, Ann. You can take my spot if you'd like. I'll get one for you. I'll get two for you. Go. Okay. A couple right, things I want you to observe no, in Ann. You're in. I She's planting before the ball comes I out. Obviously, ball. we've been doing that all day. Yeah, you came She's in after She's straddling me. the line of the ball. So she's getting one foot on either side of the line of the ball as it comes out of the machine. Okay. And then the last detail is small but important. The plant is very explosive. It happens very, very quickly to create as much possible time between the plant and hitting the ball. So there's two different things happening here at two different speeds. The plant is explosive, and then we passively wait for the ball to come into your block. Right? So fast and then slow. Fast and then slow. Okay? So we're going to go to the green line behind her, and we're going to step up and we're going to replace her. Okay? Keep hitting that until I tell you to step out, okay? Going up. Last one. Okay, step out, Ann. There we go. You're in, Susan. Thank you, Ann. Can you pick up two tubes before you go? Good. Good plant, Susan. That was great. Straddle the line of the ball. Get your foot right around the line. What? I can't hear. Yeah, that was great. Sorry. That one you could have yes. gone a little further Can on. Stay? No. Okay, what time do you have to leave? I really want you to get okay. around that ball. Get that yep. foot around the ball. So, you just yeah. step past the ball, past the line. We go the ball. until 10. There you go. That was a good That was a good one. You don't have to stay. Just if you would let let Brent or I know that you're leaving, then he'll uh, adjust for you. Yeah, very beautiful block. You're not slapping anymore. Oh, that That's beautiful. Oop. Yeah, that was good. Okay. 
Okay. This is going to happen. Huh. Yep, good. Let's just try calling it. You're making a nice solid sound. Ah. Good. Okay, keep practicing. You're doing everything great here. Got your plants is great. Your line is great. You're strong, nice and strong. You're not stopping. Go ahead. We're going to have a drink. You can tell the ladies to have a drink. Yep. Drink time. You have to go? Drink time. Okay, no worries. All right, let's end on a really good one, Susan. Let's end on a really good one. There it is. That was a really good one. All right. You can go grab a drink. We're going to do forehand next. What? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. It was, wasn't it?